Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in iPhoto 2011 and I'm going to be showing you how to create slideshows very easily. The first thing that you want to do is you want to go ahead and put all of the photos that you want to use in your slideshow into an event. If you do not know how to do that, all you need to do is create an event, drag some pictures into it, and then give that event a name. Once you have all of those photos in that specific event, double click inside that event. Down at the bottom, you'll see an option that says create. Click that there. Click create, and then you'll see a few options become available. Click on slideshow, just like that. It'll go ahead and import all of those images into a slideshow format. Now what you can do is you can choose the theme. So there's a whole bunch of different themes that you can actually preview. So here you can hover your mouse over them and it'll show you the different effects that the photos will do and the actions they will take within that slideshow. So choose the one you want. I'm gonna choose the vintage prints option here and then click choose just like that there. Now that slideshow has that effect or theme applied to it. You can then go down to music right here and import music from iTunes or anywhere on your computer. Click on the song that you want to use. So select a song just like that and then click on choose just like that. Now that song will be the background music to your slideshow. If you want to get into the more details of the slideshow, click on the settings icon, which is down here in the bottom right, the little gear, click that there and you can adjust how much time is in between each transition as well as just a specific slide. You can adjust the color tone of that if you want it to be black and white, sepia, and so on. You can also fit the slideshow to the music. That way it'll fit a song exactly. Change the aspect ratio to HD TV, iPad, iPhone, whatever the format you want to use. Once you're done editing all of that and you're good to go, you can click the preview button or the play button. They're pretty much the same down here in the lower half of the panel. So I'm going to click on preview now and now that is going to be previewed just like that. So that is how you create a slideshow within iPhoto 2011. If you have any questions on how to go about doing that, please put them in the comment box below. I do my best to get to those as quickly as possible. Thanks as always for watching my videos. If you would help me out by clicking the thumbs up button below. If you want more content just like this, subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys next time.